Episode 45, Revealing the Truth. Dora. Aiden patted the little girl's head and smiled brightly. This was the same little girl he had rescued from the kidnappers yesterday. He was happy to see her, but he hadn't expected they'd meet again so soon. Dora, why are you here? Dora pointed to the silver BMW and said sweetly, I came with dad and grandpa. Just as Aiden lifted his gaze, he noticed a middle-aged man emerging from the white BMW in a dignified fashion. Wearing a well-tailored gray suit, the man was rather handsome, with a strong build and graceful features. He glanced at the people and shops around him with ferocious tiger-like eyes. One could tell just from the way he carried himself that he was a man who had held a powerful position for a long time. It's Anthony K of K Group. I've seen him on the news before. He's one of the Bayside District's top 10 entrepreneurs. I even heard he owns a 1,300 square foot villa in the northern suburbs. Do you really think that Mr. K's come all the way out here just for a bowl of soup? Mr. K bent down to help an old man out of the car. Dad, your waist isn't completely healed yet. Please be careful. Sure enough, this was the same old man Aiden had helped at the market yesterday, also known as Dora's grandfather. The old man looked at Dora, who was currently hanging onto Aiden, and smiled lovingly. Then, with Mr. K's support, he stood in front of Aiden. Aiden, I came here today to thank you, he said sincerely. If it wasn't for you, then yesterday, Dora would have... Fear surfaced in the old man's expression as he spoke. Aiden smiled. It's no big deal, he said. You didn't need to bring all these people here just to thank me. The old man wanted to say something else, but a slightly plump, middle-aged man suddenly squeezed out of the crowd. He approached Mr. K and greeted him in an ingratiating tone. Director K, do you still remember me? I'm Walter Gilmore from Feitang Company. Anthony K's reply was cold enough to send a chill down the man's spine. In that case, I won't keep you from your meal any longer, Mr. K. After the middle-aged man had left, the old man realized he had yet to introduce himself to Aiden. My surname is K, and my first name is even easier to remember. John. This is Dora, as you already know, and this right here is my good-for-nothing son, Anthony K. Anthony K, in contrast to his earlier coldness, smiled kindly at Aiden and handed him a business card. I won't waste any more of your time on thanks and praise. If you ever need anything, come find me at Kay's group. Your Uncle Kay can help you out with all sorts of problems. Wow. An audible gasp of envy rose from the surrounding crowd. In Bayside District, getting the chance to talk to Anthony Kay wasn't something that happened every day. What on earth could he have done to make the Kay family care about someone as unimportant as him? Noticing that the atmosphere at the front of the shop had changed, John could not help but ask, Did something just happen? Aiden smiled bitterly and told him the whole story. John shook his head and laughed. Oh dear, it seems that we deserve to be blamed for causing this situation. He turned to look at the large crowd in the street. With a voice filled with vigor, he announced boomingly, Everyone, you have all misunderstood young Aiden here. He then proceeded to passionately recount everything that had taken place at the grocery store yesterday. Finally, he demanded, How can he be a brave young man and a scheming thief at the same time? It's absurd! Only then did everyone recall the news about the heroic events that had taken place at the grocery store yesterday. I remember! Last night, the Arklands Police Department posted an article about it. He's the kid who rescued a little girl after chasing the kidnappers for over a dozen miles on an electric tricycle. It was him! I can't believe it! We almost mistook a hero for a thief. We should be ashamed. The crowd exploded into cheers and applause. Ding! Receiving praise for doing good deeds. Morality, plus one. Current progress, one out of ten. Current level, beginner level. <laughs>